I'm super dark. Uh, uh. I can't even see me for real. Let me see what I can do. Ooh. I remember when I used to do videos like this. <laughs> I had to like use the lamp. I would bring the lamp down from my dresser so that it could be brighter on me. <laughs> I remember those days. And yep, the lamp used to sit right there so you could like see me, but you couldn't see me. Anyway, I'm tired, y'all. It's Friday. Um, last time I looked at the clock, it was 10.35. So you still got like a little little bit of time to enter the giveaway um so yeah i think it's like it's my most recent haul from when we went to the concert um so it's just a couple of videos back so i'm trying to get this up within the next 10 minutes so if you haven't entered you can enter because yeah i'll be announcing the winner tomorrow um, I already mentioned what the winner would be getting in the haul video, but I'll be revealing the prizes tomorrow when I announce the giveaway winner. So, you may want to enter. Mm -hmm. It's been a very, very long day. I have not been to sleep. I didn't go to bed until like damn near 4.30 in the morning, knowing I had to be at work. <clears throat> by 9 30 and i haven't been to sleep yet so i'm about to look up this movie called gemini man it's with will smith in it he's supposed to be like a clone or something so i'm probably about to roll up and watch that and um yeah go with the world Gina just went in the bathroom, so it's just been a long day. So yeah, I did. We made it to Ulta, um, so I could go pick this up. This is one of the prizes, um, and then while we was there, Gina picked up this Avino. Positively Radiant Max Glow Infusion Drops. Um, it's supposed to help with tone and texture. Yeah. So, she picked this up. And then I finally picked up the full size of my favorite new foaming cleanser. This is by Formula 1006, and it is Be Berry Ready with blackberry and coconut milk. I absolutely love this daily cleanser, um, and it's only eight bucks. Like, oh my gosh. So, yeah, um, I feel like this is a cleanser that you can use it year-round, um, especially if you have the right moisturizer. So... I have a formula 1006 um, moisturizer, but it's a matte formula, and in the wintertime, my face, especially my inner center face, um, my T-zone area, it gets super duper dry. So, um, I'll probably be using oil, vitamin E oil, or some type of face serum as a moisturizer um, this winter, but for a cleanser love this stuff i had a sample fell in love with it and uh or was it like a deluxe size it was on sale at ulta one day and i picked it up and i fell in love so i just pick, picked up the full size and then this is what i'm most excited for gina's on the phone in case you guys hear in the background um i picked up a new palette and i don't have a palette like this in my collection this was a steal i kind of lucked up and got this because i think it was like the old, the last one other than the tester and i think the other one had like been picked at i didn't even know this palette had came out 
and I initially wanted the melt um palette the smoke palette I wanted that palette so bad the one with the pretty pretty greens in it I really wanted it but I didn't have it to get it at the time but I feel like I found something better and it was way more affordable it was only 15 bucks by makeup revolution look at the packaging y'all this nail is coming off like I think I'm gonna go back to my regular acrylics I love my ombre but Mm. But yeah, this nail is hanging on for dear life. Probably going to end up putting a band-aid on soon. But anyway, look at this packaging of this $15 palette for Makeup Revolution. Bomb. So it is the Chilled with Cannabis Sativa Eyeshadow Palette. Um, and it comes with... 36, 9, 12, 15, 18 different freaking shadows, people. Yes. And it was only $15. And look at the packaging. Gorge. It is called the Chilled with Sativa. Chilled with Cannabis Sativa palette. Um, and pretty much this collection is infused with um, cannabis. So they say. Uh, you can definitely Google it, but anyway, I'm super excited about this palette. And while I'm opening it, so you guys can see what it looks like, um, I have a Pretty Little Things haul coming in the next week or so of some fall goodies. So I'll be sharing that with you if you want to stay tuned for that. Just FYI. Okay, so it's like in a tin little packaging like kind of sturdy but kind of like travel friendly because it's compact and y'all wait till y'all see these colors and it comes with a huge mirror and of course the shadow protector y'all look at these freaking shadows like ain't this cannabis in a box if not St. Patrick's Day, if not perfect for fall, and green makes me happy, whether it's money or something else. So, yeah, and then compare this to the color range in the Melt Smoke Palette. Pretty damn close if I say so myself. Look at these glittery shades, perfect for the holidays, and then you have some frost shades, shimmer shades, matte shades, and the names are cute. So we got Hybrid Goddess Dope Plant. This word right here. Mm -hmm. Calm Huff Leaf Bud Candyland. Come on now. Sativa is this really pretty shimmery brown. Cool Natural Haze, which is this gold shade. Mist, burned, relax, and this pretty rose gold color is called Exhale. So, um, yeah, you have like some really pretty reminiscent colors in yellow. I wanted the Urban Decay Honey Palette, but I honestly just wanted for similar colors like this. So, it's like a win-win situation. I got the Smoke Palette pretty much urban decay honey palette and some dope as greens like all in one and it'll go great with my warm tone shadow palettes so yeah love this palette if you get your hands on it get your hands on it it's only $15 so I'm gonna have fun with this palette come um, around Thanksgiving and this would be a great palette for, like, even if you were doing some type of um, look for Halloween. If you don't already have a colorful palette. This is just, this was an awesome find. So, yeah, that's it. That's all I wanted to say in this video. Let me get this up so you guys still have a chance to enter the giveaway. I will be announcing the winners here on YouTube tomorrow. Probably tomorrow evening. And then um, we'll go from there. Um, 
so yeah let me let me chill let me chillax let me get my mental together y'all i'm so tired this was a long week it was a good week it was a long week and honestly i'm surprised the bitch made it through it um it wasn't too too bad <laughs> it was just like my first week on the floor and like really seeing if i can do it because i'm really iffy during training if i can do a job because it's like okay this is training it's monitored and then when i really like get on the floor floor that's when i really test myself like bitch you, you gonna be smooth as long as i keep my cool and yeah uh in about another couple of weeks probably be making a run to the healing store i'm kind of running low on sage and um kind of want to look at some new stones probably be getting my nails done in the next couple of weeks the harriet tubman movie um comes out in theaters november 1st so you guys know i'm gonna vlog about it duh um but yeah i'm about to see if gemini man is on the screen i've already seen um what the fuck was it godzilla i like godzilla i watch godzilla king of the monsters um of course i've seen hustlers already i told you guys about that in a couple videos back a few videos back actually and ready or not it was cute because it was stupid <laughs> um but i've seen that and there's some other movie that we just watched and I can't fucking think of it and I'll think of it as soon as I cut the camera off. Ooh, I'm trying to get a pimple right there. Nope. About to nip you in the bud. Um, I want to see Queen, uh, Queenie and Slim when that comes out. And the Harriet Tubman movie. Of course. So, yeah, we still got Halloween coming up. So, so much more. Hit the bell. Subscribe. Follow us on social media, comment, rate, and share, and just stay tuned. Check out previous videos. Have a good weekend, and I hope you guys had a good week, and have a good week next week, and I'll see you guys the following weekend. Peace. I don't know. We might try to go to the Harvest Homecoming with my mom tomorrow. If we do, you know I will include you, but we'll see.